Hello, and thank you for watching Garden Nibbles. I'm Deidre Oda McKende. We're here today at the Simpsonville Park where there is a farmer's market going on. So I'm going to take you in and visit with some of the people who are out here demonstrating their products at the farmer's market. I hope you enjoy it. watching Garden Nibbles. We are here talking with Harvest Bread. Is that what it's? Great Harvest Bread Great Company. Great Harvest yes. Bread Company. Yes. So we're located on Woodruff Road. Um, we're right there near the New Fresh Market. Um, we all started in Montana, but we're a freedom franchise. So we are able to be as local as possible. So that's why we come to the um, local farmers markets. Um, all of the Great Harvest freshly mail their whole wheat flour there at the store. We do no additives or preservatives, and we just have a lot of great bread for sandwiches and breakfast and um, great for gifts as well. Show us some of your product. So down here we have our Dakota, our cranberry flaxseed and whole wheat sourdough. Any of our breads that are 100% whole wheat, we use honey as a natural preservative. And then we also have our old-fashioned white as well. Which one is... Um the most popular seller? Our most popular out of this, maybe our Dakota. This one, a lot of the Great Harvest will have. This one has the pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds, sesame seeds, and millet. And this is 100% whole wheat with our freshly milled whole wheat flour. So this is your price list. Talk about it for a minute. Yes. This is going to be a little different from what it is at the bakery, um, but all of our breads will range around seven dollars at the bakery and it's a little bit more around eight here at the market um, and then our highest bread will just go up to ten but that's our chocolate babka that's just one of our specialty breads that we make mm -hmm. and the Dakota is 750 yes ma'am so what are the samples you have down here in the containers this we have our oat berry muffin this is gonna have oat bran rolled oats blackberries raspberries and blueberries and this is gonna have honey in it as well as the sweetener and then we have the blackberry raspberry savannah bars. These are going to be like a peach cobbler bar. They um, are 100% whole wheat and they have rolled oats, coconut, and brown sugar for the crust. So you're offering samples to your people that come by your booth here. Yes, we do pretty much unlimited free samples here at the market and at the bakery. If you have anything you want to try, we usually have something to sample. So you have butter and pimento cheese to to go yes, along we, with the breads. we sample happy cow unsalted butter with our breads. And here at the Simpsonville Market, um, I've teamed up with Hampton Farms because their pimento cheese goes really well with our breads. So they, they were able to donate a tub of that so I can sample that with our breads. How did you begin out here selling at the farmer's market? Um, well, I know that the owner has done a lot of research trying to expand as much as possible in the upstate. So he has done all the research to. Um, see what markets are going to be best for us to be at. We actually go to six different markets in the upstate. Um, Simpsonville is just one of them. And we also go to Greenville and Spartanburg and um, Fountain Inn and TR. So it's proven to be a great marketing tool for your business. Definitely. It is. It's worked out really well for us. The farmer's market. Yes. Thank you for your time yes. today. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, 